This is on Monday. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting ready for work. So I just got back from my very, very long day at work. I went to Inflatable World with the kids, which for people that don't know what that is, and for people, some people won't, I didn't. It's just a bunch of trampoline, bouncy castle shit in indoors. So I went there with about 20 kids, and we were there all day. Now I'm super tired. But... Welcome back guys to another banging video that I'm creating today. So I'm off to Bunnings right now to do some more on the shelving situation that I'm doing in my room. I gotta look for a nice dark piece of wood and then some pipes. Um, they go down like that and then I'm gonna hang my clothes on it. It's hot. <laughs> section and it seems like they don't have what I need so I need really I don't know so that's what I want but it's 900 and I need 850 it's not looking good guys I found another one over there but that was like one that you actually like put in the wall I don't need this to go into the wall it... <laughs> So I got the shelving, there it is, got me a pole, that's too long, so I gotta cut it. Now it's it's dark and depressing. But I will get to finish finish the shelf tonight and clean my clean the other half of my room, put the couch and get all lights done. It's gonna look good. I just got home and I've unpacked all the wood. Now I'm drilling the holes for it and I pre drilled it right on the kitchen bench because that's where the best lighting is. And then there was food on the other side, so I cupped it and blew it. Didn't realize it would come back, it went in my eyes, and I was like, ah. It was very funny, they are still sore. <laughs> it's oddly satisfying taking off this plastic. If I can get it. You know what you're doing? something very important to talk about in this vlog but before that I'm gonna go to the shops so yesterday Casey Neistat uploaded a vlog called sad story and if you haven't checked it out or don't know who he is leave a link in the top of the description below for you to check it out you should go watch it and he basically talks about how um, there's this foundation that grants uh, dying kids wishes and one of the kids wishes was to meet Casey Neistat and he went on about how even though he didn't know him it still um, like affected him and that sort of um, sort of like brought back memories of like when you go through high school, I guess, and how it's like hard for everyone. Like I, I wasn't the most popular. I didn't have like that many friends. Um, I still got through high school. It was tough, but it just shows that um, everyone else in life 
does have their problems and even though you don't know them or know their problems it can still affect you and how you live your life. High school was tough and I'm sure everyone else has their own stories of what high school was like, like the popular people they would say that it was the greatest time of their life and all that shit and then, then there was other people that say it wasn't and I am one of those people because I didn't enjoy high school that much. It may be because I like didn't have many friends or any friends towards the end of year 12 which kind of sucked or like you get bullied but that, that makes you stronger so that I just wanted to say a little bit of a motivational speech there and let some things out because I felt like sharing it with you because I like talking to you even though I don't get a response it's like talking to a brick wall I feel like it's good to talk to you and let it out so yeah thank you for listening and we will be back to the normal vlog now strap pop hot as black top in that black top eyes flutter as your back lock grip tight on your hips like a padlock is the pad so i have come to a dog friendly park not just for the only reason to look at dogs and play with them but because there's a nice bush over here and I'm gonna do some exploring in it. This lighting is beautiful because the sun is behind me. But there is like a very, very big tree over here and it looks nice. Don't forget to breathe. Go story. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go story. That is just a massive tree. It's ridiculously big. That's what she said. And now I'm gonna do some exploring. Probably shouldn't have worn these shoes or jeans for that matter. But it's just. I can hear water. There's a waterfall. Let's just walk along the side of this little little river and see where it takes us. It's quite a nice little, it's a peaceful spot. It's nice. It's, it's very, very chilling. Not like spooky chilling, like, oh no, I'm scared. Like, chill, like, relaxing. under your foot I guess and like a hillbilly racing chasing after you with an axe it's all nice at the drive-in at KFC right now getting lunch after my little adventure through the woods hope you enjoyed it it was pretty fun it was chill it was nice and relaxing. Now I'm back in society, getting food in the traffic and the roadworks. And then off to home. Thanks. And I'm gonna call it quits for today's vlog. It was a bit different, a little bit emotional. Hope you guys understand. Let me know what your experiences were like of high school. And I'll see you again. Yeah, yeah. Stop.